Yeah, my, my dad used to take it. Okay, in there is an annual pass holder only store here at the German Pavilion. It's open until November 17th. It's been open for, um, I think about three weeks or so. So let's head on in and check it out. Guess where I am, everybody? I am in the German Pavilion. I am in the pop-up store of the, for annual pass holders only. Only annual pass holders can get here. And this is um, this opened last month, I believe, and it opened till like November 17th or something like that. But don't quote me on that. But I want to get in here and show it to you. This is only for annual pass holders. Some I've heard had to wait in line. I just got right in. You just have to show your pass holder ID and your license. And they were using a Q, um, a virtual queue system too, I heard, but I didn't have to use that. I just got right in here. So I'm going to walk around here and show you what they have. Looks pretty cool. All right, turn this around. Not busy in here at all. Very quiet. Barloni. Awesome. All right, let's check out some merchandise close up. These are adorable. Look at these. It's supposed to be for the, yeah, for the German pavilion. That big old pretzel handle. $19.99. I've heard some of this stuff is 30 to 40 percent off, and then annual pass holders have like an additional 30 percent. So you can get some sweet deals in here. You like pajamas you're definitely gonna like this and I'm not sure how much he's, this one is smaller kids version is $34.99 yeah. I got a bathrobe a lot of that like elk on it an elk $59.99 it's, it's considered a small that is nice very soft too Here, look, World Showcase I have 50% off. And then I think you get um, get 30% off as a pass holder, so what, that's like 80% off? I have to double check on that, but I've seen other YouTubers discuss that. So I think that's correct, but I have to make sure. So $14.99, so... Sweet deal, it is. Now a sucker for these mugs, look at that. Made in Germany, too. Look at these things. Oh, this goes, yeah, this thing goes like a... What is that? This thing's connected to like beer steins or something. I don't remember what they're for. That's cool. They're uh, $12.99. I don't believe that that's the includes a discount. Always make sure you look up because Disney has all, usually a lot of decorations closer to the ceiling. Something tells me if I see someone wearing this shirt that they visit the German Pavilion at World Showcase here at Epcot. Cool looking shirt. $36.99. Oh, look at these. I've never seen these before. $14.99. That's cool. Shaped like a boot. Very cute little um, shot glasses, I think they basically they are. You know, I'm concentrating a lot on the mugs, but they have a lot of cool ones. $19.99. But remember, that's not with the discount off of it. Oh, look at these. Basically. Oh, they have socks in there. Are you sure? That is cool. Socks in like a beer can. Cool idea. So normally these will be $14.99, then you get a big discount on it. That's awesome. I don't wear long socks like that anymore, so if they had a short one, I'd definitely be into these. That's cool. Well, I wanted to mention before I go on to the next part, um, I've heard that they change these out, the merchandise from time to time, so you, what you'll see here might not be in here if you come and say a couple days after this. So keep that in mind. I think they changed things from what I heard. 
This store is the store is bigger than you think. But let me show you this. Look at that big old clock. Of course, that's just a decoration. It's not for sale, but that is awesome looking. Look at these awesome thermometers. I was just looking at these. These are like $20.95 before your discount. That is cool. Of course, more mugs. Let me show you the layout of this, this room first. And then we'll check out some of these individual things. Definitely Christmassy. I'm just going to walk through here slowly. And I'll show you some individual stuff. I think that's what I'll do. Pretty sure I've been in here when this was something else. Definitely Christmassy. Makes you wonder if there's anything upstairs. So that could be fake stairs, that could be real stairs. You never know here. Oh, see those? And the board is out. Those are coasters and it's like a little cutting board. In previous years for the food and wine, they gave those free away from pass hold for pass holders. You visit Epcot a certain amount of times. And someone told me that if you buy so much merchandise and you have a certain amount, you usually get that free. But make sure you double check on that. Oh, wait, here it is. Coaster set or cutting board with any qualified merchandise purchase of $50 or more. So that's right. I already have those, so I don't need it, but shows they have much an abundance of those. Just a small one. Alright, thank you. We have large and white. Okay, I asked about the discount. Whatever is 50% off stuff, and then you get your pass holder discount. Now he says it's 20 for a pass holder. I thought it was 30, but maybe it was 30 there for a while. They down it to 20, I'm not sure. So basically, you get it for 70% off. So you definitely get some good deals here. Well, they got some cool lavender soaps. Made in, I think, made in France. So $3.95 minus whatever the discount is. I might get one of these for my mom. I know she likes that stuff. Oh, look at this, guys. You couldn't visit the German pavilion. Well, check out some of these cool steins for sale. Awesome. $26.99. So, that'd be 70% off. Nice cool snow globe. Eleven ninety nine. And some big ones. So you gotta be careful. Like this shirt here is only the pass holder twenty percent off. Just to let you know, not the additional fifty. That's cool phone case. Some of them awesome magic bands, some past all their magic bands. $20.99, so that would be only the past all discount of 20%. Mm -hmm. I really like these Google clocks. I always meant to buy one. That is awesome, guys. 
See that one there, like that's $400, but that doesn't include whatever the discount is. And I'm assuming since this is World Shake Showcase stuff, this should be 70% off. So 70% off 400 would make that not too bad. This big one here is normally $1,900. So it's, what, 70% off of that? So definitely would be um, a lot cheaper, but even 70% off of that, it'd still be expensive. Used to have a cuckoo clock like this. Well, not this big when I was a kid, probably more that size. Just have the bird come out or something like that. So they have several styles and sizes here. And here's some smaller ones. These look kind of cool. This is from the Norway Pavilion. Let's see. I'm not sure how much these would be normally. It's normally these coats are 175. So you get the 70% off of that, so whatever that is. So it wouldn't be too bad with that off. I definitely would, I mean, I, I would like the kind of cool, but well, white would not look good on me. It looks really big and not the good big. But um, 175 full price would be definitely too much for a coat in my opinion. But um, that's okay, because you know what? They never have, see, nope. They never have big boy style for me. They never have fat guys on size. Hmm. I also a lot of shirts are not um, big boy size either. Here's some stuff that was meant for Disneyland Paris. So these were $19.99. So 70% off of that. So what would this make? It's a little over $5, this bag. And then the shirts, $36.99, so 70% off of that. Well, if I wanted a big spoon, I know where to come. France, this must be for the French pavilion, $5.95. Seems pretty sturdy, too. When you're at Disney, always look up because they always have cool stuff on top. Look at that. Isn't that awesome? And of course, the windows are very fancy for Christmas. Of course, I want to be a store without some stuffy animals. $22.99. This would be World Showcase items, so this would be 70% off. Just be careful what you get. Make sure the world's so case item or you won't have a full discount price. Uh, these are cool. I actually bought one of these years ago. $12.99. I wish I would have waved. This would be 70% off of these. They have kind of international coins. These are all the different pavilions. Well, it's not all of them like there's not a Zimbabwe a pavilion. Or a Poland. Or a Finland, but there is a or Brazil, but there is a China. USA, Canada, Italy, France, United Kingdom, Germany, and Mexico. This is a cool um cool little um yeah, it's one of those days guys, but cool little um souvenir. These are cool, but they're made of plastic, though. $14.99. Oh, I think they might... I think they light up underneath. Yeah, I think they light up somehow. That is cool. Let's see if I get one working, maybe show you. Well, look at that, guys. That is cool. Little... Ooh. That is awesome. That, look how pretty that looks. And regular $14.99, so since it's a world showcase item, that'll be 70% off. 
I'm actually getting one of these even, even though it is plastic. It's cool looking with the lights. Oh, I want to point out is that this nose it has different cycles for the lights. Just let you know. He looks like a very serious, distinguished fellow. Okay, this is a little brief walkthrough of um, the annual pass holder pop-up store here at the German Pavilion at Epcot. I hope I showed you enough, or I hope I just didn't show you too much. I took a whole bunch of pictures, I'll put it in. I'd go over everything, I didn't film everything, and uh, take a picture, and it was just, just a lot here. But I think I gave you a good overview of what this store looked like and what's in it. So when it's gone, it's in history's hands then. Hopefully I documented enough for you guys. I actually picked up a few stuff. I may show what I bought. If I do, that might be in a separate video. I don't know. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll show you the outside one more time. Thank you.